With this release, the MVC HTML Editor's Toolbar can be presented as a standard menu or ribbon. We've also added the ability to manipulate the HTML editor using an external ASP.NET MVC ribbon. Here in Visual Studio, I have an ASP.NET MVC project that's ready for using DevExpress ASP.NET MVC extensions. Let's add an HTML editor. I right-click the view code and select the Insert Extension Wizard. Then select the HTML editor. Here, I can define the HTML editor's toolbar mode option. Let's select Menu. I hit Insert, and the wizard generates all the necessary code for me. Let's take a look at the result in the browser. Here you can see the HTML editor with the standard menu as a toolbar. The menu contains all the necessary commands for the rich editing functionality. Let's return to Visual Studio and add a new HTML editor with the ribbon as a toolbar. I can do this by using the Insert Extension Wizard. But now, I set the Toolbar Mode option to Ribbon. I hit Insert and run my application in the browser. Now you can see a newly added HTML editor, but its toolbar is now a ribbon. The ribbon provides the same set of toolbar items. But in the ribbon, the items are grouped to tabs and groups. This provides better navigation, and users can also collapse and expand the ribbon when necessary. Let's return to Visual Studio. And let's add one more HTML editor, but now with the external ribbon as a toolbar. First, I run the wizard to add an HTML editor and set the toolbar mode option to external ribbon. In the associated ribbon name field, I can enter the name of a ribbon that will function as a toolbar for the HTML editor. Let's name it Ribbon for HTML Editor. Now let's add a ribbon. I can also use the wizard. In the common extensions, I select Ribbon and leave all the options by default and hit Insert. In the required HTML editor partial view, I copy the name of an associated ribbon and change the name of the newly added ribbon. I'll remove the default ribbon settings. Let's populate the ribbon's tabs collection. I can add a single tab or a range of tabs. Let's add a range of tabs. To simplify, I'll use the default tab collection specific for the HTML editor. So here I use the HTML editor extension .default ribbon tabs static property. This provides the same collection of tabs that's shown within the built-in ribbon. In addition to default tabs, I can add a custom tab. So let's now define the ribbon width. It will be the same as the width of the associated HTML editor. And let's take a look at the result in the browser. Here you can see the third HTML editor with the external ribbon. This ribbon contains the same set of tabs plus the file tab and my custom empty tab. This ribbon can be collapsed and expanded in the same manner as the built-in one. And that's it. Thanks for watching and thank you for choosing DevExpress.